told you I'm socially awkward. I'm socially awkward too. I think we're doing pretty good for two socially awkward people. Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very important video. We are going to be exposing Exotic's lair and um, that's gonna consist of me asking him some questions while we FaceTime. I've never called his country on FaceTime before, but I'm gonna go ahead and guess that this won't be too complicated. I'm gonna see if we can do this over Facebook first. Is this even like clear? Yeah, can you what, see me? Why is yours horizontal and mine's like... Horizontal? Because you're on my computer and I'm on my phone, like filming. Okay, so how are you gonna do this? I'm gonna ask you questions. <laughs> and is he to see the hand? That's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> it's smart. Okay, I'm I'm actually really proud of myself for it. So I have found Exotic Slayer, and we're gonna ask him some very hard questions. So nice to meet you. You too. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. Why are your tarantulas so ungrateful? Oh, what kind of question is that? <laughs> the kind you answer. <laughs> I don't know, cause they're all old worlds. Right? The all old worlds are. Yeah, but yours yeah. really don't like you. They just probably hate me, they hate my voice. Because <laughs> they're usually okay when I like look through the glass, but then when I start filming and when they hear me, they probably go crazy. Yeah. Okay, so why does Miss, Mrs. Is it Miss or Mrs. Lord have mercy? Miss. Why does she especially hate you? Oh, what think I about it. Why does Mrs. Miss Lord have mercy hate you so much? Like, you must have done something to her. Probably traumatized her when she was young. <laughs> what did I, <laughs> can you explain that more? Because when she was young, I used to like give her like five mealworms at one go. Because I wanted her to grow fast. So she had to like gorge everything into her mouth. And you wonder why you get the comments you get sometimes. Reptiliatus and I were talking, and um, I said I'm going to ask you what kind of soap you use on your hands because a lot of commenters notice that they're quite soft. <laughs> I just use normal hand soap. It's not even antibacterial hand soap. I barely even use hand soap to begin with. So you don't wash your hands? It's like when I just want to go wash my hands, I don't use soap every single time because it probably affects your skin. To answer Reptiliatus's question, do you have a certain uh, comment that comes to mind regarding your hands? Um, I actually kind of predicted this to happen because I've only used my hands in the videos. I've never shown my face. So as the channel grows, people are just going to comment based on whatever they see. Speaking of, um, I'm sure you guys are all really curious to know what his face looks like. So I'm going to like describe it so first of all he has two eyes no facial hair actually actually has a really big beard he has one nose and two ears and one mouth and some hair some hair, some hair. a decent amount of hair <laughs> okay you want the other oh yeah why are your tarantulas so thirsty because i sure don't water mine like that and yours always have like a freaking swimming pool full of water <laughs> we hear the, the weather is like really hot and water evaporates like really quickly because you know that deli cup that I use mm -hmm. I, fill it, I fill it up to the top and then like within a week it goes maybe half or even depletes three quarters plus our humidity here is like crazy high so with water evaporating that's where the mold starts if the Probably, humidity is high I... wouldn't you think that you wouldn't need as much water yeah, but then the enclosures that I use are very well ventilated. Yeah, that's true. I use those so, too. Why are all your lids red? Because, well, when, when I first bought the enclosures, the only color that the pet shop has had was red. So I just bought a bunch of red. And then the next time when I went, they didn't have red. They had like pink and blue and green. So I spray painted them black. So I only have red and black now. I want to I wanna see how this makes you feel. Hold on. Uh-oh. <laughs> Does this lid make you feel uncomfortable? I I had one that color and I spray painted it black, so yes. You want to see them? <laughs> Who's that? It's a uh, shadow. Yeah, it's a pulchra. Why is your water bowl empty? Because uh, I definitely do not keep them full. Are you going to do a watering video? I would not do a watering video because that's your thing, so. 
It's a it's a good video idea. I would have never thought to make a whole video doing it though. I never thought that it would go viral. I mean, you're just filling water into dishes. What's so exciting about that? Yeah, but this this goes back to all your tarantulas hate you for some reason. That is true. Question I was curious about: If you had to sleep with one of your tarantulas in your bed all night, which one would you pick? Pink zebra beauty. Campistratus. Yeah, youthless. Yeah, youthless. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. I'd probably say my youthless species red. So hard to find that species here. It's hard to find it here too. I have no idea how I I got two females. Like, really lucky. Pecco has a question. He wants me to expose you. So, oh, he said since right. since exotic slayer is not the original name for your channel, was that new name inspired with dark den? Since den and lair are synonyms, expose that. Yeah, correct. He is right. I, I mean, actually, my name was Hyraxus before. I'm, you probably don't know H Y R A X U Z. Well, I met up with my uncle, and I we talked about how we're gonna make my channel grow. And he said the first thing that I should do is change my name, because that Hyraxus makes no sense, and people are not gonna remember it, right? Yeah. So I actually wanted to do something like tarantula, cave, <coughs> tarantula boy. Tarantula dude or something like that. Then he was like, "Don't limit your channel to just tarantulas." So I thought of the next best thing, which was exotics, because that includes snakes, scorpions, tarantulas, and all. And then exotics only wouldn't be. I mean, I'm pretty sure other people would have that channel name.、Mm -hmm. So I thought of something else, and yeah, dark den. I thought of a synonym to den. And then it was something along the lines of lair, so yeah. But we talked about this before, and I already knew the answer、yes. to that. And I told him <laughs> is um for for the people watching. I was thinking about changing my channel name to、um, Creatures Corner, and it was kind of I was gonna do the same concept: dark den, exotic lair, Creatures Corner. I decided against it; it's not happening. But I think that's smart. So you're gonna keep yours to. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna stay as a tarantula cat. So my other question, so I like did the math. Like I did six hundred thousand because you have a well, you have over six hundred thousand subscribers now. But six hundred thousand divided by five thousand is like a hundred twenty something. So you're like a hundred twenty something times more YouTube famous than me. How does it feel? I still feel the same as since I mean, like when I started, but it's just that I just can't. Reply and can't interact with anyone with everyone, as I mean, as good as how I was able to. I still feel the same. I don't feel any different. You still act the same. So, well, I met so, you in like January, and I I don't remember how many subscribers you had then. It was, I think I feel like it was like seven thousand. January. Mm hmm. About ten thousand. Maybe I I don't remember. I just remember you commented. Um, you commented on one of my videos, and I clicked, and I was like, "Oh wow, this guy's channel is like pretty big." Like, and then I ended up meeting you later on Facebook. Then I created that watering my tarantulas, that first one, and that just went up. I don't even remember like that happening. I, like, I didn't even notice that you gained like a hundred thousand subscribers so quickly. Wow, Starbucks. Yeah, you want to talk about that? So there's this Starbucks gonna open near my place. My sister is like going crazy. She keeps asking, "When is the Starbucks gonna open?" And I'm like, "I don't care." What is wrong with you? <laughs> Because Starbucks is like, it's like something really high class over here. Like only the rich can afford it. You can't one try coffee. one coffee. Okay, first of all, to begin with, I don't even like coffee. Oh. oh. For me to pay a premium amount for something I don't like. Is that the pumpkin one? Hey, do I look like a basic? You told me that you like you told me to try the pumpkin one. I、so、did. That's the only Starbucks one that I know since you told me it. So what are your pet peeves? Oh, you probably don't know what a pet peeve is, do you? No, not really. See, this is something that I always forget. Like between countries,、um, sayings are different. Things that like like little things that bother you, like your and your getting mixed up. That's a that's something I would call a pet peeve. Oh, I I thought it was I I thought it was something pet related. Yeah, I had a feeling that's what you were thinking. Tolerate 
when there and there are like T H E I R and T H E R E S. Yeah. Like T H E R E, it's like over there. What is that? <laughs> it's a dog. How old are they? Like four, four or five. How old are you? You want to tell the world? No. <laughs> I'm 12. I know. <laughs> okay, well, um, I'll let you go. I think, I think I got what I needed to expose you, so I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye-bye. All right, so there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know this was probably a really weird video, but sometimes weird videos need to be made, and there's people like us to make them. A lot more little collabs and and things you know coming your way and to like this video if you enjoyed subscribe if you're not and you want to stick around and I will see you guys in my next video